Um, you know what? Let's do an apply on run real quick, and I think this will probably be our last run of the day. Polyam is a new character of ours. We can suck up enemies with our uh, active for stat boosts, which is kind of cool. Uh, I've thought about it before, yeah. I, I think I probably will eventually. Let's see what you are. Shot speed down. Yikes. And excellence. Very yikes. Um, our damage is base. Our speed is base. So we're good in that regard. Many themes on parental abuse, Christianity, dogma, and much more depressing stuff. Yeah, there, there, there's a lot. Isaac, uh, if honestly, if you like Isaac as is, don't look into it too much. It's, uh, it's a bit messed up in that one. Finish the first one and fire mine. Yes, we'll take that. Flaming tears that is actually passive damage. Don't take my charges, you freaking nubbin. Almost done the second. I'll have to check it out. I, I've heard good things. Uh, I've been meaning to check it out at some point. Our mind, not necessarily a damage up, but kind of a passive damage up. It's not bad. Um, soul heart. I would like that soul heart. Use a controller. I'll keep that in mind. All right, trite. Will you super jump? Will you super jump? Do it. I know you're going to. Every trait super jumps. Uh, bomb the key. Um, I might bomb my donation machine for that soul heart at the end. You know, let's wait for the end of the run. See if we need to bomb in the first place. No, no spawn spider. Okay. <laughs> we can do that too. Sure. I didn't realize that was uh, a different version of that, and not to mention it was a freaking champion, so it literally one-shot us. That's, uh, that's a yikes for sure. Thankfully, it was on the first floor, so I guess not too big of an oop. All right, Needle, can you, uh, can you get here? Uh, egg. Uh, oh, I was going to freaking suck that up, you nubbins. Uh, egghead, conehead, right? Conehead? I think that's conehead. Uh, conehead. That is indeed conehead. Grants a soul heart, gives Isaac a chance to ignore any damage taken. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take that. I'm not gonna suck that up instead. Uh, unless my boss item is really, really good. But uh, that's, uh, that's good for our soul heart for next floor, so we can lock in our devil deal. I'm gonna go angel, just because we're on two red hearts right now. If we get maybe some more red hearts, then, uh, we'll, we'll think about it. Okay, jumper, relax there for your super jump, mate. I really hate, uh, playing against jumpers and trites in rooms that have, like, any form of obstacle that can jump over. The super jumps are kind of ridiculous. Uh... BFF. I mean, I like BFF. Do I need BFF right now? Probably not. But BFF is good. I will not deny that. Okay, the freaking nub ends are back. Stop it. There we go. They keep our mouse last night, and I suck. Uh, couldn't jump regularly because of it. That's uh, that's an oof for sure. Get rid of one little monster buddy. And. Oh, the tier height screwed me up. Uh, champion version. You are a blue champion. Which means I think if I kill you last, I get a soul heart, theoretically speaking. But trying to kill you last is so difficult. I'd much rather kill you first and then kill the baby after. Yeah, I was gonna do that. Screw it. I might still get the soul heart. I don't know. I think you have to be the last one. No, no, no. Not your tier. All right, perfect. Let's get you up against the wall, and then just bounce you off of it here and there. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. That was a wee bit unfortunate. The bounce did not work in my favor for sure. Uh, range, I'll take that. Um, why'd I get flies? Is that a new thing with uh, mom's underwear that I'm not aware of? Huh, okay. Let's grab Common Head. That will give us our soul heart. Let's check this real quick. Children are gremlins. 
Yeah, children are small gremlins. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. They look like an alien now with the cone head shape plus the horns. Kind of kind of interesting. All right. So range up wasn't bad. We have now locked in our devil deal. There is a potential sore heart here. Let's try and grab that. Completely botched that though. There we go. It's a chest. Sure. Heart plus some coin. Sure thing there, game. Conehead horn tears, yep. And let's get rid of the spider spawn before we uh, focus in on the gusher up there. Uh, not going to go for curse room. We only have one soul heart, so we need to keep that in mind. This room is not great as I have no real stat ups outside of range. Doesn't do much for me except for, well, more range, as that would imply. Get rid of the spider generation, ASAP. Stop spawning more spider generation, please, and thank you. This is quite rude. All right. I'm drowsy. Okay, that's actually good to know that we have that in our pool. Uh, even better yet, we have luck foot now. So not only is that a luck upgrade, but that means that we get all good pills going forward. So kind of like a pseudo PhD in that regard. So that's actually really good news for us. We get like little baggy pills. That could be a good source of uh, stat generation or stat ups rather. Perfect. Um, do I want to go for the shop? I don't think so. Though we could get a soul heart now that we have five cents. So not a bad option, theoretically speaking. No, why not? Let's see. Uh, wow, we have PhD now as well. Uh, PhD will allow us to know what they are. It is better pills, but honestly, I think with luck, but we don't really need that anymore. Oh, this is atrocious. Uh, I'm gonna bomb you next to that key, or rather, kill you next to the key. That would be ideal. Okay, well, I neither was able to get you next to the key, nor was I able to avoid your damage. So that's awesome. I don't know if I have a soul heart anymore. Eh, that could be trouble. Uh, do you have a soul heart back there? Contradicting whatever you want or plan? Pretty much. Pretty much. That, that is how it goes. Was there a soul heart in shop? If there was, I'm going to take it. Just in case. There was not. Unfortunate. Um, instead, let's go into the double key room. And see if we can get anything worth our while. Ooh, there. Forgot about the spikes. Well, that is... Pretty useless, I am not gonna lie. Let's bomb you for. Okay, uh, four spiders, two coin. We just used 15 cents to get two cents back, basically. Awesome! Love it. That was, uh, that was good stuff. Good stuff, game, good stuff. Uh, I'm going to drop a bomb. I was hoping that you're going to jump at me. You did not, though. I want you dead ASAP. Because I don't know if I have soul hearts. Health up. Uh, that's now three red hearts. I don't want to go for devil still. I really don't. Okay, looks like we still had a soul heart uh, that last round. Or maybe not, because didn't we pick up half a soul heart? So I guess we had only half a soul heart, though. Yeah, so we, we picked up half a soul heart. So in that case, we only got half. Alright. I really need some stat ups. I haven't wanted to eat any of the items just yet. Uh, I wanted the health up, I wanted the range up. Especially the range up. The range up, at least you know what you're getting for the stat. Whereas when you use Void, you don't as much. Uh, this room looks atrocious. Because they're all going to shoot at me almost at the same time. Keywords, of course. That's not exactly all at the same time, especially when you 
set them off differently like that. It'll be kind of rough to kind of go around one by one and try and destroy them. Yeah, so far our run's not going great. What does eating items do? It gives me a stat up. Um, I don't know if it's randomized or not, though. Wow, you took so long that the door's open for us. That's a little bit sad. To be fair, that room was kind of atrocious. Holo! That's a thing. Well, I guess we got some keys out of it, which is nice, except I just pushed one of the keys back in. Um, let's use a bomb for a chance of two keys. We got one key. At least it's uh, five cents for five cents. So, that's fair. That is fair. All right, let's try and group up the bomb flies so we can destroy them all at the same time. Try and save some time here. Okay, there we go. And we got a pill as well. Uh, range up, not bad. Fool card, we could use that potentially in conjunction with like a curse room or a uh, challenge room to avoid the enemies. Wouldn't be a half bad idea. Just need to get rid of this head of the keeper first. Alright. Please leave, giant monster buddy. That'd be much appreciated. Yeah, I have too much health. Uh, switcheroo. So it is an active item, and I don't want to suck this up, so... When you have an active item, um, the void will then gain the effect of the active item as well. That's another factor to keep in mind. That one I don't really want to suck up because I don't want that active. And I can't get a stat up from it, so kind of a moot point. Kind of a moot point. Okay, well that was unfortunate. Good news, we got the super, or the secret room. Actually, super secret room. Uh, bad news is we took some damage. Only half heart though, so I guess not the end of the world. I say as I almost take damage immediately. Like, how do they expect you not to take damage this room unless you have something that can kill them wicked quick? Primony. Uh, chance of spawning multiple. Uh, oh, baggy pills. There we go. That is what I want. I will take that, please, and thank you. All. Uh, cards now become pills. Tears upgrade. Tears upgrade. Yep, this is what we do now. We are going to be using a ton of pills. Very happy about that. Let's try not to blow ourselves up, please, and thank you. I say as I'm going to blow myself up almost immediately after saying that. Um, please move. There we go. Pills. No pills. Please increase our chance of pills. Holy hell in a handbasket. Uh, stand here. There is nothing I could do there. Like, what could I do? Come on now. Tears. Oh. Uh, one bomb for many bombs? Yeah. I Like, I had to hope and pray, basically, that the the bombs weren't going to set off a chain reaction of gas. This ga The game is a professional troll. Like, the creator of this game just coded it so that it trolled whoever played it. That's all it, All this game is. Let's be honest here. Wait, I'm just gonna use my bombs. My, my damage is not great. You are. Die, please. And no angel room. But we got two to flight. Uh, if we use the void on this, do we keep pseudo flight? Nope. We did not. I tried. I tried. Alright, let's go down. All right. Um, okay, sure, sure, game. That seemed really fair. Just shoot out that spider at lightning freaking speed. Yeah, flooded caves. It's uh, a different variant of uh, the caves that can spawn. I think I may have unlocked it recently. No damage up is rough. I think that is a tears up there. It is perfect. I need a soul heart. I need a soul heart. I'm gonna take damage here. There's nothing I could do. 
There was nothing I could do right there. I either took damage from the chain guy or I took damage from another guy. Uh, actually, not necessarily true. Sometimes there can be different enemies. Well, I don't have any more slow hearts, so might as well go in here. Dangerous item, but is a damage upgrade every floor. Yeah, we'll take uh, Blood Oath. I'm Drowsy Toad. That's actually pretty good. Uh, Blood Oath. At the beginning of every floor, it will stab me, removing all of my red heart health. Uh, in doing so, it will give me damage based on how many red hearts that it takes away. So, not a, uh, a bad item, but I need red heart. Red health, rather. Because I'm lacking it right now. I also just need damage of some sort. This is getting a little bit rough for us. Maybe I need to suck up some items for some damage ups. Or potential damage ups. I can't guarantee what static gives me, and that's the hard part. Okay, Pooter. We're at half heart now. Uh, more eyes, eyesore. Basically, we can shoot in many different directions. Um, I feel like we're gonna die here. I, oh, there's a needle too. I didn't even realize the needle was here. I. Alright then. That was a close one. My tears up saved me because I was able to uh, keep it at bay. Uh, soul heart here. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's take that real quick, shall we? Uh, let's increase our angel chance by blowing you up. Get some money back too. And you know what? I'm going to take a, a red health just in case. Just in case, methinks. And let's get going. I guess I could have went taken a peek into the boss room. Not that I think it would have been a good idea. Uh, I was really hoping to kill you. Uh, double key room. We've already been to our item room. We've already been... No, wait. Have we? Yeah, we have. Into our shop. So yeah, we'll open that up and hope for something worth our while. Maybe something that I can suck up with the void. Very good. Range up. I like it. And lots of money. You know what? That's okay. I'm fine with this. So, 32. We could grab Fanny Pack back there. When we take damage, we drop consumables. Um, isn't bad in theory. It's not great either, mind you. But, okay. You need a chill there, tapeworm. Okay, well, I said chill, and you did the opposite. Wait, what? How do we just take damage there? I could have sworn that I dodged all the tape room shops, unless it was the leech that got me, which is not outside the real possibility. Freaking tier height. Oh, this room is atrocious. We're taking damage. We're taking damage here. This is such a god-awful room. Because you just have to hope and pray that you're able to strafe in the right location, basically. Uh, I'd rather keep the drowsy pill, though, but maybe. Right now, we're not doing bad. We've gotten rid of most of the white tapeworms, which is what we need to do, as they have directed tears versus the black tapeworms that don't. Um, yeah, let's try and use our drowsy pill on the boss. Let this one go down here. All right, that was a wee bit scary. A turret. Let's pay attention to that fact and try and stay in its blind spot. I'm gonna move around. Easier said than done, though. I'm trying to move around this room. But your leech is also chasing you. And like I said, easier said than done. Thankfully, our angel chance actually did not go down. Uh, I think because it's at the lowest that it can technically be, based on the floor. They still took damage, which is less than ideal. For you godforsaken monstrosities. That one's a champion, too. If that one hits us, I think we die. Thankfully, not the case. 
you and you. All right. Um. Well, let's hope that we can beat the boss here. Drowsy, abs freaking lootly. No, 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 not that chi, not that chi. Yeah, that makes it a lot easier to dodge those. Those uh, the shockwave is still really hard though. Can we use a bomb? Uh, of course he would jump. Uh, of course he would jump. And also my bomb's not even landing where I wanted to. Okay, well we just went down to a point five. Or 5.5 rather, and we're one hit away from death. The shockwaves are just so hard to predict, honestly. They really are. Yeah, we 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 uh got a few upgrades. Unfortunate. Yeah, wasn't uh, a great start to the run, but unfortunately, I do not have time for another one. Uh, Final Isaac uh, runs usually go between 30 minutes to an hour, so I think that will be the last one there. But with that being said, as always, if you did enjoy the show, make sure to hit that follow button. If you haven't checked us out already, please make sure to do so over on twitch.tv for us guilt spire if you're over on YouTube. And make sure to check out our actual life campaign as well. We're trying to help heal kids at Sanford Children's Hospital here in Fargo, North Dakota. But as always, guys, I'll see you next time tomorrow at 5 p.m. CST. Bye-bye!